Oh, but you've done half look at plum crew that Father Christmas get up. I've been down the market letting the kids have a lucky dip. Anyway, that Stanley Baxter geezer looks even funnier. And he gets paid for it. Mm. I should have got a bit here on that vet programme, you know, all creatures great and small. Mm, I always wanted to be a vet. Well, you're the one with GCEs, Ronnie. You could have been a vet. If you weren't so worried about where well, you'd have to stick your hands. <laughs> yeah, BBC One are having a rat on Christmas Day. Yeah? I don't know why they don't have a turkey like everybody else. Thank you, Rodney. Here, look at that. That's what you want. Christmas culture. Royal ballet doing a nutcracker. Yeah, I ain't surprised in them tights. Hey, BBC One's got that film Gandhi on. There'll be a rush down the takeaways to get the curries in when that one starts. <laughs> Be even more rushing about after they've eaten it. <laughs> <laughs> An awful lot of these farming programmes on, aren't I see that Ben Kingsley's playing a part of a silage manager now. Derek, that is Silas Marner. It's quite a famous novel, actually. I, I see Tenko's having a reunion. Mm. It reminds me of the time I was locked up by the Japanese. There are not yeah. some good stuff on the telly, Del. Yeah, I know. It's really great. Oi, hey, go and get your own copy of the double issue Christmas Radio Times. It's got a lovely picture on the front. Touch of class this year. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.